today's video. Today, we're gonna be putting in the axle, the motor, the spindles, the wheels and tires, everything we will be installing and hopefully going for a test drive. So let's get straight into it. Now I will be putting the axle on the dingo. Rolling chassis. Sheesh. Things coming together. But yeah, I'm about to put the motor and I'm about to put the chain and all that. So let's get straight into it. So I've been working on the wine harness and uh, yeah, I'm basically done. I got under underglow that I want to put on, but right now it's not connected. I got the battery connected. Now here, you got your ignition switch, you put the key in and then that goes on. That's from Red Bear Garage, check them out. Then you got your lights, it's very bright. Uh, then you got your signal lights, uh, let me show you, flip the switch, see it's that side, safety for that, and then when you hit the brakes, hooked up a switch here, 
bolted it onto the rod. And when you hit the brakes, the red light turns on. So basically, it's like a car. I even got a little horn. So yeah, it's turning out pretty good. So lights off, engine off, kill switch, horn, and this is switch. I finished the whole wiring harness. Everything is looking good. So now I'm going to be going for my first test drive. So let's get straight into it. be doing a motor swap I bought a new 212 and I'm replacing the old 212 with the new one so let's get straight into it it's gonna have the stage one kit and yeah it's gonna be pretty much stock well not really so I installed the motor and the stage one kit so now it's time to see if it runs so let's run the stage one kit So it runs good, now that's all that matters. No sputtering, no nothing. Thanks for watching this video, see you next time. All right, so I went on the test drive. I went down one block and already something happened. You can see there is no chain at all. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see, but there is some metal, bare metal there. So I'm guessing uh, the, how to tell, the, uh, the sprocket, the sprocket hub. You see right there, the silver piece. Got, got contact with the chassis and stalled and the motor was putting power and the chain flew off I don't know where it went because I had the cover on the I don't know where it went it's so confusing to me I gotta find it somewhere in the, in the sidewalk so yeah so let's go install the new chain
my butt ready for a test drive and uh, everything is looking good. I got uh, everything working, the, the chain is on, uh, the axle, all that stuff. It's all put together, everything's tightened. Everything's working good. I got the top roll cage on, as you can see, all painted and everything. Uh, everything's working, that's all that matters. And it's about time I go for a test drive. It's been a while. Hope you enjoyed this video. Caught majority of it on the GoPro, and uh, I had a lot of people talk to me about it, and uh, a lot of people liked it, which is really good. Too bad I couldn't use my light bar. Or, I mean, I can't really use it at night. It's pretty loud for the neighbors, and I don't want to get the cops called on me. I saw a cop when I went on the street, and the cops almost came after me. So, yeah. So, thanks for watching. Catch you guys in the next video. See?